Is it on? Greetings, one and all. We're here back for a Transformers review, finally. I did say I've done this review already. It was part truth. It was shit. I redid it. So that's why it's taken so long. I've been working. Just changed shifts again. No more nights. I think. I'm not sure. Never mind. As the part of the title page, we'll be doing Alternator Mirage, and my dog cannot stop sniffing him. Leave him alone. That, thanks for that. Alright, obviously. Alternator Mirage engines. Ford GT. Now this, I love this, this, the alt mode for this guy. I mean, look at, I mean, look at it. I don't know about the detail you can see, but if you can see in there, look at it. There's a lovely silver auto bottle over there. It looks lovely. He's also got the Ford symbol on the front there. He's got the Ford GT at the side, which is lovely. Nice chrome wheels. Oh, I mean, the paint job is what? The colour, I could just say, is cobalt. That's what I'm saying. It's cobalt. Cobalt blue. And it just absolutely looks lovely. Now, what's in the back? I don't know if you can see that. I don't know. I can't see myself. There's Mirage. Kind of. If you can get this guy, even if you're not a great fan, just get him for the alt mode because that is stunning. It is lovely. It's Granted, he's not a Formula One car, but I don't think they've got the license to use Formula One models. But there you go. As for weapons, stored in the usual place, but then this one's slightly different because his. But it opens up like, like that. Kind of. And there's a weapon there. There. Gun. Yes. Right. Gun. This is quite clever. Splits into two. If you don't know this already. But like classic Jeffire. Yeah. So he has two guns. He gets to shoot people twice. There you go. Come back to the guns later. I'll take them out first anyway. Lovely, isn't he? I mean, oh, now, I think I'm going to show you, try and show you the inside of it, but you probably can't see, so I'm going to have some pictures put up as well, like, now. I mean, the interior, the detail of the interior on alternators, on some of them anyway, are quite lovely. Yeah, so, I love the detailing on these. That's why I'm an Alternators fan, because I love the details, because they go from a really good alt mode into a, well, some, this really good robot mode. I know some have got a lot of kibble, and some have got very little kibble. Alternate Mirage, now let's see him in robot mode. Now, the transformation sequence is about to come up. I do, and I'm now doing bios, as you knew by my Hot Mod G, uh, Target Master Hot Rod. I'm using his G1 bio, because the Alternator 1 is, or Bartek 1, is shit. So, enjoy. Function, spy, motto, who and what I am, I hide from the enemy. Mirage is not thrilled about being an Autobot freedom fighter, prefers hunting turbo foxes on Cybertron with his high-priced friends. Effective fighter, more effective intelligence gatherer, electro disruptor, can cast illusions altering his physical placement and appearance for up to six minutes. Expert marksman with armor-piercing rocket dart hunting rifle, Unsure about a butt cause can't be fully trusted. Right, I'm back. Hope you enjoyed that little funky bio transformation sequence, would say. So, here is Mirage in his robot mode. Oh yeah, he still looks quite funky. Alright, uh, you know. Obviously you've got some lots of kibble on the back, but usual. These doors you can store in several ways. You can fold them backwards. Down like that. Which is probably what I'll do actually, guess what, that just looks better actually, to be fair. Fold them down like that. So on my Rodimus I have them like that. For some strange reason, but there you go. There you go. And the shoulders obviously you can have them at any angle, very creaky. Any angle you really want to get the arm to make it look really funky, so there you go. Now one thing about this guy, he hasn't really got a very G1-esque head. Because I haven't got a G1, so I'll have to use uh, classics. You can see the head's quite rounded. 
quite squarish, but you get the idea, you know it's Mirage. And the one I'm going to be getting, I realise I shouldn't, because it's pointless getting him, but then it's just like getting a repaint really, it is the clear version of him. You can get him, I know you can. Every auto assembly I try and get one, but they never have one. I got this guy 2008 auto assembly, I got him with uh, Barnetech Grimlock, oh there of course. That cost me 65 for the pair, so that's about 30 something each, which to me, for him, because he's fucking hard to find and he's rare when you do, he's quite expensive. I thought, fuck it, I'll splash out. No. I think it was the last, book. last thing I bought or something that year, because it got rather expensive. But hey ho, life goes on. 2010 on assembly coming up soon. Only four months, 120s. Well, at the moment it's 124, 23 days. It's AA. So there you go. So also awesome Mirage. There he is in his lovely robot mode. The articulation is thus. Now bits will move because this chest piece is meant. I'll just lift it up for a second so you can have a look. Go off camera for a minute. Finger, uh, there's a little tab there, which these little tab bits here, you'll see them sticking out the side there, they're meant to sit in. They don't clip, they sit, which becomes a bit annoying at times. Drop this gun, never mind. It just sits there, like so. And if you can't see, there's that, oh, there's that lovely Autobot symbol. Lovely Autobot symbol just there. Looks rather nice. So articulation. Sorry, back to the articulation again. Arms. That's about as far as they bend upwards. You got wrist. You got that's the whole arm moving, of course. To get the wrist to move, I've got to hold that bit still. Wrists, obviously. Four through sixty. It all bends back. Only gas for transformation. Arms actually have a joint. Two joints in the elbow. You can see one there, one there, so you can do. Yeah, look at me. I can't do Mirage's voice, so I'm not going to try. Um, articulation in the legs is thus. You can do the the, the, the kick that people, some people complain about. So like, oh, yeah, kick. I'm not going to say it, but there you go. You can do that quite well. I don't know if you can stand while doing it, I haven't tried. And he's got the basic bend in the knee which isn't good you know the transformer that can't bend his knees it's not worth talking about alternator mirage I would like would have liked to have got the bottle tech one because he'd have a bit more chrome or silver to it I can't remember what they do differently but he'd be metal as well but he's plastic which is alright because metal is prone to scratching the paint off quite easily because I can say that with my alternate wheel jack you connect the roof to the back Oh, you know, even on um, the plastic version, like my brother's got, they've still got a little scratch on the back. I mean, it's just when it clicks together, and obviously you, you accidentally scratch it. Don't mean to scratch it. Why would you want to scratch a transformer? Because how shit they are, you know. But there you go. Alternate Mirage. Now, I hope you enjoyed this video. I will try and get more out. Just finding the time and energy. Because I've had a lot going on recently, so. That's why you haven't seen much of me. So, sorry about that little outburst of happiness then. But I hope you enjoyed this. Sorry about that. Battery died and I couldn't find the main bit to plug it into the camera from the juice, so then try to wait the battery recharge. So I've been to work since then. So just forget it while it's a bit darker. All I was gonna say was well, you kinda of guess what I was gonna say anyway, but there you go. I've been Will, you've been you. This has been Alternator Mirage. Hang around after this video because there's more to come. What well, basically says what my next review is going to be, so just don't click off yet. <laughs>